If you are a fan of the Buick Grand National like I am, then you are going to love this piece. It is in about 164th scale, so about three inches or so, a little under, right in about that era. That's what you'd expect from a Hot Wheels car. Uh, while we're here, we'll look at the card. I'll shine the light on it because you're not going to be able to see that in the catalog, so I will shine the light everywhere so you know that we are not hiding anything. We don't want to hide anything, and we can't when we shine the light on it. So the first thing you see is a little bit of a bend right here. Really get that light in there so you can see it. That affects your decisions on this. Well, then better we get it out of the way now. For the most part, I think most people, it won't. A minor imperfection on an otherwise really good card um, and a fantastic vehicle inside. This is a re issue of this particular mold repainted for the 2011 Hot Ones series. Let's jump right in here. I'll let you look at the car itself while we check out the bubble. So we'll let that light go all over the bubble. It's tough because it's so uh, clear. <laughs> it's almost like it's not there. There we go. I want the light to shine off the bubble, but because it's so clear, it's not cooperating. You can see the original uh, manufacturing info right there if it'll focus and again the light shining off of it no cracks no uh, discoloration i'm checking around make sure there's no sharp edges or any parts where it feels like it might have some crush wear or some dimples some bubbles and none of that either nice and tight on the card so other than that one little imperfection here we'll also check on the back for you just so that you're aware But otherwise, looking pretty good. So there you have it. Hot ones, hot wheels. This is the, give a year on this. Nope, just a Buick Grand National in brand new updated colors.